Salman Khan got blessings from a little boy on the sets of musical reality show Sari Gama. Yes, apparently the small boy Jayesh Kumar has miraculous powers, claims music director Himesh Reshamya, who is also a judge on the show. Salman was blown over by the kid's performance and applauded for his Tantana Tantan Tantara rendition. Jayesh apparently went to seek blessings from Bhai. Instead, Bhai told him that he would like to take blessings from him who has such a magic. Himesh also went back to the time when the boy touched his father's head and he recovered so well. Obviously, the kid has some talent as well as inner strength which makes him what he is. Salman meanwhile is also busy with the release of his upcoming tube light which is surely going to win the love of the masses. With the blessings from a small angel, we guess Salman is well on his path to success. What say? Salman Khan would be shooting with Sunil Grover and Ali Asghar in a show and this is surely going to be an entertainer for all. Yes, for those who have come in new, Sunil Grover and Ali Asghar, who were a part of the Kapil Sharma show, were not a part of the team after an ugly spat mid-air between Kapil and Sunil. For fans of Kapil Sharma, the show went on a downside after Sunil, Ali, Suganda and Chandan left the show. Yes, the team has been split into two and Salman would be shooting with those who left Kapil's show. Apparently, Ali is close to Salman and Salman wished to help him out of his temporary lull in profession. Anyway, the shoot was a success and viewers would surely get to see this on television. Salman, meanwhile, is busy with releasing Tube Light on June 23rd. Indeed, a great moment for all Bhai fans. Hena. Sir, so, uh, you just said that, you know, it's very difficult to say no to a woman. And uh, recently, I mean, yesterday only, uh, actress Priyanka Chopra met PM uh, Narendra Modi and she was criticized for wearing a dress, uh, you know, during her meet with him. And uh, people said that that's not the dress code to wear when you meet a PM. So what do you have to say on that? Madam, I'm not PM, I'm Priyanka Chopra. How can I give you an answer? So your opinion. Huh? Your opinion on the criticism that she received. Uh, Sir, uh, you just said that, you know, it's very difficult to say no to a woman. And uh, recently, I mean, yesterday only, uh, actress Priyanka Chopra met PM uh, Narendra Modi and she was criticized for wearing a dress, uh, you know, during her meet with him. And uh, people said that that's not the dress code to wear when you meet a PM. So what do you have to say on that? Madam, I'm not a PM, I'm not Priyanka Chopra. How can I give you an answer? So your opinion. Your opinion on the criticism that she received? Uh. The month of June will begin on a very high note with Salman Khan and his tigress Katrina Kaif gracing their dazzling performance at the first official press conference of IFA New York which will be held at a high-end hotel in Mumbai. Besides the tiger and his tigress, the fairy actress Alia Bhatt too will be present along with some of the cream of B-Town. Wizcraft Biggies 2 would be gracing the event and all in all it will be quite an interesting one to see how Salman and Katrina fend off questions thrown at them. The main event will be held in New York on the 14th and 15th of July and will have some of the greatest showmen from the world of celluloid. Well, this one event we would never want to miss. What about you? Recently, the news of differences cropping in the relationship of Ash and Abhishek has gone viral and while Abhishek later sarcastically responded on social media to that he himself was unaware that he was getting divorced thanks to the perpetrators of these rumours in a caustic manner, he asked them to also reveal when he would be getting married again.
having heard from Junior Bachchan when Big B Amitabh Bachchan finally spilled the beans about Ash and her place in the Bachchan clan. When Ash shared a picture of herself with daughter Arathya from Kans, the proud father-in-law shared it on Twitter with the caption, Bahu Rani or Rani. This showed how much love and affection was there in his heart and his birth definitely laid the ghost to rest, so it's only a matter of time before the rumour dies down for lack of fuel. What do you think? The young contestants at Sare Gama Pa Little Champs were in for a surprise as two very special guests made their way to the show. Who were they? Well, none other than the Khan brothers Salman and Sohail Khan. Out to promote their upcoming film Tube Light, the two brothers play real-life siblings as well and their bonding will be something to look out for in the film. Meanwhile, the little champs at the show could barely manage to contain their excitement as Salman and Sohail were at their entertaining best, so much so that the little champs and host Aditya Narayan were simply bewitched by the presence of these tube light stars who brightened up the show with their charismatic presence. Based on the backdrop of the Indochina War of 1962, Tube Light will unfold a host of emotions including a cross-border love story. All set to release on 23rd June, Tube Light has all the elements to make it an engaging watch. Don't you think so? Meanwhile, let us know if you too are excited to watch the fun unfold on Sarikama Pa. Well, this is for all those who have been watching Ulya Vandur sing her famous song every night and day. The video would be out soon and here is a deco into the introduction. Ulya is singing the song as we have already told you in Himesh's album. Ulya had also sung this song for Salman on social media once and everyone just loved it. Meanwhile, rumours of a possible relation with her and Salman did make rounds and are still being talked in hushed whispers. And Ulya is enjoying it all. Henna, Ulya and Salman do make a great jodi but they haven't confirmed anything as yet and for us Ulya is just a mix of romance, style and fun. So is she going to also sing in Salman's upcoming films? Nah. Till now, we have only seen that Salman is not really promoting her songs, so maybe this too would pass. But for now, enjoy this song. Salman Khan's upcoming tube light has come out with the firat look of its next song, Naach Mini Jaan, and doesn't it show a perfect bhaichara? Yes, showing both the real-life brothers Salman and Sohail the poster surely brings back fond memories of the two together and aren't we loving it? Set for a grand Eid release, Tube Light has all the ingredients of a perfect Salman entertainer. Well, this first look surely makes us want to watch the flick instantly, but hold on till 23rd June and you can watch not only Naach Meri Jaan but also the flick. The movie has Chinese act with Zuzu and Salman is then getting ready with his next tigers in the hem. Well, for now, enjoy this first look and do let us know how you feel after seeing it. The social media is smouldering ever since the recently divorced Malaika Arora shared a smoking hot picture taken at Karan Johar's birthday bash. My my, the Chaya Chaya girl has indeed turned on the heat big time as she flaunts her sexy back and well-toned body. Leaning against Shweta Nanda, the beautiful daughter of Big B Amitabh Bachchan, the two lovely ladies would definitely make quite a few heads turn and it's tough to believe that they both are in their 40s. Well, looking at Malaika's sizzling picture, all we can say is, older the wine, greater the taste. No wonder the web world is still reeling from the high. So what do you have to say about this picture? Do let us know by commenting in the section below. We all are excited to see on-screen bonding between Salman and Sohail Khan in the trailer of Tube Light. And the interesting fact that while Salman addressed his brother as Bandhu, they later reciprocated by calling him Kaptan. 
fans are pinning to see the relationship between the two, which marked the beginning of a journey into unknown lands. So, it is only apt when Salman shared a rare unseen picture from his childhood where he is seen posing with his brother. Caption the picture Bandhu, at the rate Sohail Khan or Kaptan Ka Baihood. giving us glimpses into his life as a kid well quite an interesting way to promote one's film and give fans a treat we wonder if this is a beginning of a new trend or is it a one its kind never to be repeated happening so what do you think of this adorable pic let us know by commenting in the section below Kapil Sharma's woes began following his infamous mid-air fight with his co-star Sunil Grover, who then bid adieu to the show. In a show of solidarity, other stalwarts like Chandan Prabhakar and Kiko Sharda took with the show, and the TRPs went downhill ever since. So much so that the channel was planning to pull the plug on the show unless Sunil was brought back. There were rumors that the channel intended to launch Salman Khan's Daska Dam in the Kapil Sharma show slot, but as the tiger is busy with his shooting commitments, Daska Dam has been postponed to January next year. This gives Kapil a breather of two months in which he needs to pull up his socks to raise the TRPs, and it seems that following the episode of Shraddha Kapoor and Arjun Kapoor. The comic show seems to have found its humor back again and in the meanwhile couple can heave a sigh of relief for the time being but will the upward trend continue well only time will tell while we two wait and watch do share your comments in the section below and keep watching this space for more updates uh, Vivek ji uh, police ka kirdar kar rahe hain aap correct yes lekin uh, agar uh, public place mein agar aapko kabhi kisi ne kaha ki are police ka kirdar to wo tube light wala zyada acha karta hai तब तब क्या टेक होगा तब तब क्या टेक होता है आपका क्या कमेंट होता है उस समय आपका क्या 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 विचार आते हैं आपके दिमाग में क्या विचार आएगा बोलेंगे बहुत अच्छा करता है और जब पार्ट थ्री आएगी मैं भी देखने जाऊंगा थैंक यू तो आप ऐसे क्यों करें जब कोई कहता है बोलो ना मैं बोल रहा हूँ मैं कहना चाहता हूँ ठीक है मैं ही बोल जब कोई कहता है ऐसा और नाम भी नहीं लेके हाँ पिक्चर के नाम के पीछे छुप के जब कोई कहता है ट्यूबलाइट वाला बोलो सर मैं पूछना चाहता हूं अगर ऐसा ऐसा है तो ऐसा और आप आप तो कैमरा पे भी नहीं हो आप तो सिर्फ आवाज से पूछ रहे हो विवेक जी पुलिस का किरदार कर रहे हैं आप करेक्ट यस yes. लेकिन आ, अगर पब्लिक प्लेस में अगर आपको कभी किसी ने कहा कि अरे पोलिस का किरदार तो वो ट्यूबलाइट वाला ज्यादा अच्छा करता है तब तब क्या टेक होगा तब तब क्या टेक होता है आपका क्या कमेंट होता है उस समय आपका क्या 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 विचार आते हैं आपके दिमाग में क्या विचार आएगा बोलूंगा बहुत अच्छा करता है और जब पार्ट थ्री आएगी मैं भी देखने जाऊंगा थैंक यू तो आप ऐसे क्यों करें जब कोई कहता है बोलो ना मैं बोल रहा हूँ मैं कहना चाहता हूँ ठीक है मैं ही बोल जब कोई कहता है ऐसा और नाम भी नहीं लेके हाँ पिक्चर के नाम के पीछे छुप के जब कोई कहता है ट्यूबलाइट वाला बोलो सर मैं पूछना चाहता हूं अगर ऐसा ऐसा है तो ऐसा और आप आप तो कैमरा पे भी नहीं हो आप तो सिर्फ आवाज से पूछ रहे हो Salman Khan has a protective and a caring nature towards the needy This is what Manisha says about Salman Khan in a recent interview She says that she has interacted with Salman during Khamoshi and has seen him being very protective even towards Sanjali La Bansali who was a newcomer then thus showing that he always encourages those who are wishing to go up to the ladder of success. Well Manisha Koraila back after a small sabbatical in Hindi movies sure has some dumb for what she has said is not false. Bhai does have a softer side to him even if he is worshipped as the favorite action bhai of Bollywood. <music> Meanwhile Salman Khan is busy with tube light his Eid offering to fans. Of course the year end would see him in Tiger Zinda hai the sequel to Ek Tha Tiger. With so much happening and a sequel to Dabang also being planned Salman Shubha knows how to squeeze time for being caring. 
है ना